Madonna. Simply saying the word aloud makes me feel powerful. Even walk the face of the earth. Sue I'm instating a new policy a where I can play Madonna Madonna's fan. greatest hits over the PA system Wouldn't quite loudly that. throughout the entire school day. Responsible for my take no prisoners demeanor and my subconscious tendency to always be desperately looking for someone named Susan. And now my what? Cheerio squad this year finally has the talent to make that dream come true. You will not take that dream from me. Do you not understand the blackmail process and how it works? This. Oh my God. Smile. What? Well, the answer to that question is usually date a younger man. So let's see some arm candy, uh. girl. Sorry, freshman. You're going to have to start trolling the middle schools. You know why? Because if you want to be as riveting a performer as Madonna, a skill that will match you. I hate them. It's about dating. Not that I'm dating anyone. We all know that Finn and I are no longer an item, and for the sake of the team, I broke up with Jesse. Have you? What do you think? Dude, why won't you close no your deal. eyes when you're kissing, weirdo? For a girl, it is. It was two years ago, so maybe lose the vampire makeup and consider some tighter fitting clothing. Oh. You've got the pow, and I believe you should work it more if we're going to be an item. That's got a sting. Oh, what? So hey just guys, like that, they're together. I'm sorry to interrupt that your little storyline, but I couldn't help but overhearing. <laughs> and maybe along the way, uh, we can find a way to help you too. Oh gosh, please stop. We just said in the last episode you need to be single for a while, and yeah, you're just already. <laughs> Sloppy freak show, babies. Somewhere in the English countryside, in a stately manor home, Madonna is weeping. Just like your hairdresser has empowered you to look absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> she hates his hair. I'll see you later, Sue. That means. When I pulled my hamstring, I went to a misogynist. Oh my gosh. What it means is. What a dummy. Put yourself in their shoes for a change. Put your love to the test. You know, you know, you got to. Mercedes should have every solo. He plays soccer with my sister. He's seven. <laughs> He's seven? I need a younger, inferior man. Uh, if I don't find one, Coach Sylvester will kick me off the Cheerios for sure. Hello, Finn. What like, is wrong, wrong with these seven. two, especially the boy? We already tried with Finn and he hit me. Sue. Um, yeah, thank you for coming. They're, oh, yes, yeah, they're no, playing no. Madonna in the school. Okay. I just realized. Um, I was just They're wondering actually why playing playing in this school my office. Something in the way you love me won't let me be. Mm. I don't want to be a prisoner, so baby, won't you set me free? Stop playing with my heart. Finish what you started. When why you would you dance around him? Down. Like you're singing to you him after that conversation. I wish two of the students in the background would just be like, hey, we're trying to study. That was good. Totally. Awkward. With the hair jokes. Oh, by the way, how's the Florence Henderson look working out for you? <laughs> the Brady Bunch. The Brady Bunch. Maybe you should try a new setting on your Floby. Oh, snap! You know, kids, I grew up with a handy, capable sister. My parents were famous Nazi hunters, so they weren't around a lot. I had to bring her up on my own. I didn't wow. have a lot of time or money to keep up with all the latest looks. There, I said it. I think we can help. Why would she Mercedes open up black. that quickly? I'm gay. To... We make culture. Go on. 
We're working on an exciting new project and would like to use the Cheerios. That is very interesting. I don't normally pause, but very interesting. The seeing a little, I like these moments where we see a little bit of why Sue is the way she is. But it, it is worth noting that just because she's given an explanation still doesn't excuse her bullying everybody around her. You deserve epic romance. Mm -hmm. what a way with the I feel words. badly that I pressured you into, you know, going all the way. I'm willing to wait. I you tell me when you're ready. to slap him. And I'll make sure that I'm fastidiously groomed. Why is he constantly talking like this? And at your place. Oh, oh my God. Uh, why is everybody planning so, on doing the nasty? What do you think? Not that it matters. I couldn't agree more. Didn't they just say last episode, like, they had that big emotional scene about, like, how we're not going to do this because, Vote like, take one. he needs to be single for a while. Strike a pose. Is that Sue? Look around. like a different person. I mean, if you, I wouldn't even believe it. It's almost like creepy. And Catherine Lana too. Will Schuster, I hate you. Ladies, <laughs> Kurt, Kurt, like, oh my god. Don't just get through the wilderness. Not this song. Somehow I made it through. I didn't know how lost I was until I found you. Touched for the very first time. I'm uncomfy. Only on Glee would this be your first experience is a choreographed dance to Madonna. Oh, hey there, Whoopi. Don Nuts. What happened? Well, I'll tell you what. All those Don costumes and hairstyles. I'm going to leave. So you're going to have to take me to a burger joint. Finn, I How do you feel? Stand. I don't feel anything. Because it didn't mean anything. what happens it's what happens when you just make stupid decisions like that so Finn once again the Mr. only Schuster? one dumb enough to go through with it oh yes. my goodness I'm Jesse St. James can I talk to you about something oh no you would never be with me completely if I were on the opposing team and I care about you more than winning another national title no. so I love focal adrenaline I don't you. believe it Oh. Ready, you Kurt and had many solos. Show. We've been treating the girls like crap. Not caring about great. their feelings, not listening, objectifying. That's the right word, right, Mr. Right. Shoe? Objectifying. <laughs> That's the yes. girl I have to. Life is a Oh, oh, oh my gosh. That rip was insane. Oh, there you go. 
All right. So that is episode 15. What a wild episode. I, I do love getting to see some of the, you know, backstory on Sue. Um, like I said, it doesn't excuse the fact that she's terrible to most everybody. But uh, I do enjoy seeing kind of why she is how she is. And seeing that different side of her with the Madonna music video. Oh my goodness. Like, that was bizarre. Um, I, the, the new guy has come over. I think he's still trying to sabotage. He's, he's, a, he's a spy. He's a spy that's been sent over to kind of sabotage him. I love the ending number right there. And I also love that no matter what issues are going on within the group, when they all sing together at the end, they're all like happy and on the same page. Because I think that is very reminiscent of like, you hear about bands all the time, rock bands from history and even today, groups of uh, people who sing, who, you know, they have issues, they butt heads. You know, I think about the Beatles. The Beatles had times where they just couldn't stand each other personally. But yet when they went out to play music, they were all on the same page and they were happy, you know. And I so I think that is cool that at the end of every episode, no matter how much they've been in each other's throat the whole time, they end every episode happy on the same page, you know, working together to, to get the song done. Good stuff. Episode 15 will be back Monday with episode 16. Thank you guys for watching. Take it in. Soak it up. Bye.